I may have to drink two bottles of wine tonight before going on stage. We're having a few minor problems here with the electricity simply because uh, the uh, Transformers cannot seem to handle the amount of amperage that we're contributing to the stage. So we would ask you to be patient. We'll try to get out here just as soon as we can. Until then, go take a piss or get something to drink or kiss the person you're in love with. Thank you. I consider myself to be the ultimate anti-rock star. Yeah, another huge festival for Typo Negative. You seem to be um, the favorite headliner this year, last year, next year probably. I hope so. It's like when you when you go outside, walk uh, through the crowd. Um, it's like uh, at least 70 percentage of uh, all the people out there have Typo Negative shirts. That makes me very nervous. <laughs> Why? Because it's huge expectations. Exactly. It means I will have a lot of people to try to please. Well, I must say that my songwriting comes from my heart. And how I feel is based upon my environment. As things change around me, of course, so does my songwriting. Uh, Bloody Kisses was written when I was home, you know, when I was working. And uh, when I was, when I had a girlfriend at this time and stuff, and so some of the songs happened to be, you know, based upon her and this and that. Most of this new album, October Rust, I wrote sitting in the back of a tour bus on this, this, this little keyboard that I have with like a drum machine and stuff like that. So it's hard to be inspired when you look out the window and you have no idea where you are. It's like everywhere looks like you're on Mars to me. So I really had to search my soul to come up with ideas for songs. learn anything about yourself and did you find any new aspects of your personality then? I've learned that I have to live with myself for the rest of my life and I'm not perfect and I have accepted that and also I realize that people are not perfect you know just in general that you have to weigh the good and the bad and if someone's good points outweigh their bad points then they're a valuable person and if it's if it's the other way around then uh, I try to find new people to spend my time with.
I don't like to be looked at. I don't like to go on stage. I don't like to go food shopping and to have somebody run up to me and want my autograph. I feel horribly embarrassed that someone would ask me for my autograph because everybody bleeds. It's, it's my fans that have put me here, that have made me in, into what I am. So if anything, I should be asking them for their autographs because they're paying my bills. You can't just uh, prevent yourself from uh, like being idolized in a way, being an icon plastic for them. Surgery. Plastic surgery. <laughs> How is Pete Steele going to look after plastic surgery? Like you, exactly like you. Come on. Yeah? A little bit.